We've driven four hours south of Malibu, 15 miles south of the border, to Tecate, Mexico. And some of you may have heard of this town because they brew a pretty good beer here. We came here for the red clay roofing tile. Redland Clay Tile Company is manufacturing our tile. We're going to get together with George Cortez, their quality control manager, who's giving us a tour of their factory. Come on. George, I thought that all red clay tile was made out of red clay. Not really, Bob. Actually, uh, it's a combination of clays and a granite. And what we do, uh, we blend that uh, clay over there, which is called the olive Olive clay. Olive green, yeah. yeah. Olive green, and we use the local clay, that brown over there. Which is and brown. A, yeah, and some granite. And what we do... And Where do you is, get all that? Is that from around here? Actually, it's about 60 miles from here, from okay. the plant. And what we do, we'll, we'll blend it all up in here, and then uh, this is the finished product. So you just right mix here. it up on the ground and create yes, this, that's it, that's this bunch it. of stuff. Some of it is indeed olive colored, and some of it is brownish red. Right. And then what? And then what we do uh, with the skip loader, once the load is, um, once the mixture is there, we'll uh, dump this into the hopper over there, and then we'll start the, the, the grinding process. So you begin breaking it down into a finer, finer material. Yes, yeah. Uh, what it is is uh, we have to just uh, bring the pieces down to a, almost a, like a powder cons consistency. Uh -huh. And this is the first step, dumping it in exactly, here. Exactly, yeah. So George, you've got you've got the material down to a fine, fine clay, and now what happens in here? Okay, what happened in here, Bob, is this uh, fine powder, this fine clay will come, will be transferred to this hopper, and then it's mixed with water, and it's pushed down into the vacuum chamber of the extruder machine, and will come down at the other end. So this is the vacuum chamber of the extruder over here. This is pretty old equipment, isn't it? Yes, it is. It is uh, quite old. Well, here, Bob, we can see the tile coming, the final tile coming out of the extruder. At this point, uh, we're making the two-piece, but we can change this die to any type. You know, we can make it to the Baja Mission, to the S-style, to the lightweight S-style. Depending on the head that you put there, that exactly. determines the shape exactly. of the tile. To the, to the cutter. Yeah. And, and, then, then, and then here, the machine tapers the end of it. That's correct. Uh, each single piece will be exactly the same. Yeah. And all the waste just goes right back up to the hopper. Exactly. We do recycle all the clay back in there. And from here, where do they go? You put them on racks? And yeah, we put them to the racks, and they are taken all the way to the dry room. Let's go take a look. OK, let's go. The design of these kills is really centuries old, isn't it? Yes, it is, Bob. This is something very unique about Redland Clay. We're keeping up the tradition that started a long, long time ago in the 1500 with the, with the, uh, the people, colonial with tile. The colonial type, yeah. Now, this is pretty unusual. I, I wouldn't have expected to see them stacked vertically now. Yeah, the reason for that is because the weight, and also since we fired the kilns to about 1,850 Fahrenheit, they, they get so hot, you know, even at night you can see it glowing in there. Yeah, well, that's a lot of temperature. Now, how long does it take to make a batch of tiles like this? Okay, usually it takes about uh, two days to load up the kiln, and then about two days, 30 hours to fire the kiln, and then two days to cool off the tile. To cool it back down. Yes. So it really takes a week to make a batch of... Uh, we're up about maybe 30 feet? Just about, yeah. Just How many about. tiles do you figure are in there? Several uh, tiles? We can put about 24,000 pieces in here. Wow, that's amazing. And then can we see them being taken out? Sure. I, I yeah, let, them, yeah. let me take you over here and show you. George, you're in charge of quality control here. What are your main con concerns? Yeah, my main concern is that the tile will be strong enough, mm -hmm. uh, the waterproof, yeah. and that uh, will be the uniqueness of our colors. They are through-colored clay. That's right. They're not painted tiles in any no, way. No, they are not. Not at all.